Okay. Okay. I'm here with Rita, the director of the Edgar Allan Poe House and Museum here in Baltimore. And you were telling me earlier that Poe was a bit of a gambler. They got in some trouble when he was in school. He did. He yeah. got in a little bit of trouble. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So I'm not a I'm not a card magician by any stretch of the imagination. I don't do, I don't do cardistry. That you believe or not, that is a term. <laughs> cardistry. Uh, cardistry. That's right. Okay. However, as a tribute to Edgar Allan Poe, I do have a regular deck of cards here, and we're going to do a little uh, tribute to Edgar Allan Poe uh, right here. So what I'm going to do is I want to kind of kind of cut this real quick. I want to follow my thumb, and you tell me when to stop. Yeah. Right there. Okay. So I want you to look at the card. Right here, don't, don't tell me what it is. Okay? Alright? <clears throat> now, uh, do me a favor. Why don't you come over here to the mantle? Now, this is a, uh, a mirror from the Poe house. Could, you, could this have possibly belonged to Edgar Allan Poe, you think? I think he would have loved it. Alright, could you uh, stand next to it and face the camera? Okay. So stand right here, and we're going to take a picture of you with Edgar Allan Poe and that mirror that may have belonged to Edgar Allan Poe. Now tell me, what was your card? King of Hearts. The King of Hearts? Give me a favor, you look right here, if you don't mind. Ah! Alright, cool! That's real. <laughs> da, da, da. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you, that was awesome.